Okay, what's up? My name's Hope. I go by Rex Riches Resale here on YouTube and other platforms. Today I have a pimple patch on. So if you get a, a, get a glimpse of something shiny, fear not. It's just a pimple patch. Um, I don't know why I'm getting acne like I'm 12 again, but it's happening. I have a 25-piece sandal box from New Without Tag Outlet. I will leave my referral link in the description below if you want to check them out. Although everything sells out so fast, it's really hard to get your hands on. Trust me. I know. Um, this box was $125 for 25 pairs. And I used my referral credits from all my other purchases that I use with my own code <laughs> to pay for my shipping, which was $39.99. So all in, I'm $125 into this box, which makes my cost of goods $5 a pair. It's supposed to be a woman's sandal mix. And yeah, I got a, a couple pairs in here that are not women's sandals. I got a kid's pair and uh, some uh, slippers and a couple damaged pairs. And everything's supposed to be new with tag or customer returns but some of it's damaged so it is what it is um i have to do an honorable mention to this pair of branded black sandals i'll pop them up on the screen these sold for 30 dollars to my mom thanks mom <laughs> they're like 98 dollar leather slides um I just wanted to give them to her, but of course she's like, let me pay. She tried sending me an offer on Poshmark and I was like, no mom, no, I declined. And then she zelled me money for them. So that pair sold right away. And then I just sold another pair today for 29. So I've already made $59 um, out of the 125 just by selling two pair. And I'm filming this today because I'm, I've been listing them. They're not all listed, but I've been listing them and, you know, they're starting to sell. So I better get to it. So let's just start out with this pair. Which they're super cute. I'm going to give these to my best friend. Her daughter is in this size and she will love these. But these are kid shoes and I would never, like, these weren't supposed to be in there, but here we are. But they're Steve Madden, little gladiators. They're adorable. They are new. So those are going to a friend. And then these are Dolce Vita. These are real Dolce Vita, not the diffusion lines, but actual Dolce Vita. Gold braided little sandals. I have photographed all of these. I don't think those are listed. These Dolce Vitas sold today. Thank you. If you watch my channel, these little braided jute. Um, see the tags on them, but it's like marked out. Braided jute sandals. These sold for, they're a size 10. They sold for 29. So I gotta ship those out. Put those to the side. Then these are Mark Fishers. There's two of these in here. I don't know if I have these listed. I know I have the white ones listed. These are an eight. Um, retail value 150 on these braided espadrilles. These might be listed. I'm not sure, but they're an eight. They do like, they have the tag, but you can tell that they were probably worn around maybe in the store or maybe they were returned. Not sure, but I mean, they're in excellent condition. These are mud size nine, little jelly rock studded sandals. I believe I have these listed for like 25 bucks. These are Dolce Vita, but these are DV. Rock studded bow jelly slides, jelly sandals. And those are a size nine. And then these are Steven New York, which is Steve Madden. These are an eight and a half. These are so uh, beautiful. These, they're like a canary yellow croc leather sandal. Those are photographed, but not listed yet, but I, I'll be getting those listed soon because they're so cute. These are tray torn. Um, these are a size 36 or six. I got a silver pair. They're just slides, tray torn. I never even heard of it, but comps look like 20, 25. So, okay. And then I got a pink pair and these are a size 41. So an 11 tray torn. 
just little comfort slides. Then I got these Seychelles. These are so cute. These are like a cloud puffer. Um, these are a size six, so kind of tiny. You could tell the tag, the little sticker tag was there, but they're all leather, like cloud puffy puffer, ah! puffer slides. Tiny size six, but in really good condition. They just don't have the sticker on there. Actually, there's like a little marking there from where the sticker was pulled up. Then I got two pairs of, these are new with tag, made well, and there's two pairs. So that was such an easy listing. So these are already listed. These do have the sticker. See, does anyone know what to do to get that to like not be sticky anymore? Would it be rubbing alcohol? I don't know what to put. I'm afraid to put it on there because these are all leather, um, but they're braided. These ones are a size 10. And the other ones are a size eight and a half. Same thing. They do have the Madewell tag attached. So two pairs of those. So easy to list. Then these are a 14th and Union size eight and a half. Little hot pink python print like flip flops, the thong, thong braided strappy sandals. And then these are 14th and Union size seven. They, they do have the tag on them. A uh, little braided leopard print sandals. These are so cute. These are Steve Madden. These are rock, rock studded, which I feel like is supposed to be like trendy. Someone said that. I feel like it was Laura Von B. Uh, rock studs are coming back. These are eight and a half. Excellent condition. Like you, you can tell these have never been worn. I'm running out of space. Where do I put everything? Oh. Okay. These are Mark Fisher. These are a tiny size too. Yeah. These are a five. They're called the Jamie leather lining. Um, they're white braided, just like the black ones. These have definitely been walked on. They were probably a return, but no big deal. Those are listed. And then here's where we get into kind of the disappointment. So these are mud. Um, they are new with tag size eight. But I'm going to have to, like, they have, you know how, like, that pet or the rubber gets scuffed so easy? Yeah, I'm going to have to work on those. And they're not even, like, they'll probably sell for, like, $18, if that. Same thing with these. They are new with the tag. But they're, they have scuffs, like, all over them. That's kind of, like, see right there? It's kind of a lot of work. And these are a seven and a half. That's a lot of work for a sandal that's not going to do the best. And then we keep going with that trend. These are Steve Madden, the Pike, but they are like, look at those. It's all scuffed. I don't know. Those are a seven. And then there's another pair of those exact same shoes, those Pikes, and these are a 10. But and they have like the tag on them. But, like, look at the scuffing. I don't know if it's, like, the way they had just been stored and thrown in the box. So, <clears throat> I'll probably spend more time trying to get the Steve Maddens looking better than the mud. Because, you know, mud. And then, like, this was so disappointing. But it's okay. I'll just keep these for myself. These are abound. Just plain black abound. $10 value. You know, you just never know what you're going to get. And then... Those were size eight. Then these are also a bound. And they're like a gray, grayish black, gray jelly, size eight. Not super exciting. Then there was a pair of slippers, Dolce Vita slippers, but these are definitely like worn. You know what I should have done? I got this box. I've had it for like a month. I should have 
email them because their customer service is really good about I've had multiple things happen with boxes that I've gotten which you guys have not I don't know if you've seen any of my new without tag unboxings yet I'm I have a, the silver box of clothing filmed I just have to edit it I have a boot box that I haven't filmed I have a JC Penney box that I haven't filmed and then I'm filming this one now so I have I've had four but my first experience I tried to order a gold box the same time as my silver box and the gold I actually ordered two 10 piece gold boxes and the gold sold out and it went by for like a week and my order hadn't shipped and I was like hi excuse me where like what's going on it said three day like three to five days and they were like we're sorry but we don't have enough quantity to fulfill the gold box we can offer you a refund of 150% so like all my money back plus 50% in credits on the, our site or send you a chaser box blah 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 and I was like I'll take the 150% credit so then I got my silver box and 10 of the items did not have the MSRP that they were supposed to everything was supposed to be between 51 and 99 or 51 to $100 MSRP, 10 of the items were below 51. And so they refunded me $110 back for those 10 items. And so I used that $110 plus my 150% credit to buy two shoe boxes and the sandal box and my JCPenney box. And I added some, some extra in, but yeah, it's been a wild ride. I could have very easily just been like seven of the five pairs were damaged. Or I got a slippers. I got a kid's shoe. Like I just, it's been, I feel like it's been too long now. Maybe I might since the video's filmed. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But they, they have been really good about like making it right. So um, yeah, these are Dolce Vita. Definitely worn little sandal or slippers size seven then look at these these are like in real bad shape but it's okay Braylon wants these these are Tommy Hilfiger but like look how filthy they are they're just filthy and I'm like okay and then these both are new with tag mud again but they're damaged these are like neon yellow but the rhinestones are all peeling off everywhere on this pair and on the white pair. See the right? It's like the rhinestones. These are just really terribly made. These would have been like super cute for like a bride though, but they're just not well made, and the rhinestones are all like uncoming and undone. Like I could just probably peel it all off, but I'm not going to. Anyways, I'm happy about, you know, a good chunk of these shoes. I'll definitely, I mean, I've already made 60 bucks almost with only two pair. I'll, the Madewell, the Dolce Vita, the Mark Fishers, those will sell. The Seychelles, I'll, I will definitely profit, but like it would have been better if, you know, all the shoes were what they were supposed to be. <laughs> So up, uh, I will film my boot box next. It's really good. I was like super impressed with that. And I just don't know if I should list the booties because we're going into summer, but I don't know. It's just a quick little video. I just wanted to share what I got because I'm listing all these sandals. I hope you enjoyed and I'll leave the link down below. If you use my referral code, I appreciate it. I think you get like 15% off, I believe. And then I get uh, like 20 bucks or 10 $10. I don't know what I get actually. I think it's in the description. <laughs> I'm terrible at being a YouTuber. And that's okay. All right. Thank you so much for being here. I'll see you guys in my next one.